Hi friends, Lift It With Laura here on this beautiful day. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. This is my running buddy, Teddy Bear. Every day is so different. Every day is a gift from God. Every day is magnificently made. I'd like to encourage my friends to get outside and notice the beauty. Yesterday was rainy, gray, cold. Today it's brisk, but it's clear. You can see the sun has come up. It's a little bit later in the day. Just want to encourage my friends to, um, <clears throat> as we, as we put those things that lie behind behind us, and we move forward to those things that lie ahead, we'll notice that we can have a much more profound appreciation for living in the present. Now, <clears throat> a couple days ago, I made a video in the black of morning, it was about 5 a.m., and I used the example of using my headlamp. We can only see a short distance ahead of us. That would be the 24 hours maybe that we think we can predict, which we really can't. And <clears throat> if we were to look behind us, it would be black. So I'd like to continue encouraging my friends to put those things that lie behind, behind us, taking the lesson and the blessing, looking forward to those things that lie ahead. See Mount Hood behind me, you can see a little bit behind me. Looking forward to those things that lie ahead. Um, we must uh, continue to let go of guilt, shame, remorse, and regret because otherwise we are carrying a heavy burden. I'm gonna put Teddy Bear down. We're carrying a heavy burden um, with ourselves entangled teddy bears we are certainly carrying a very heavy burden if we carry around guilt shame remorse and regret along with us on our journey this journey that we call life on this earthly planet now the sun is starting to come up behind the, the trees there you can see look at the beautiful beautiful sunshine wanting to encourage my friends to know that Nothing is forever for my friends with depression. Many people, many of us, as I spoke a couple days ago, have what I call tunnel vision. We think we can predict the future. And I'm going to be brutally honest, the rate of suicide among young people, or any age, has raised dramatically uh, with the advent of all these antidepressant drugs. Um, I'm very, very familiar with antidepressant drugs. I've been on just about everyone invented a number of years ago, as I told my friends. I want my friends to benefit from my experience, so I've been very open. Um, it's been about 18 years since I've been on any antidepressant drugs or any other drugs to go along with it, but I was very heavily medicated for major depression, and I was on a cocktail of drugs that put me in a stupor. The reason I tell my friends this is because I want my friends to notice that, um, well, it didn't help. <laughs> I was not able to be independent and take a step back and look at my situation. I was, was relying on the therapist. I was relying on 